Hello everyone, my name is Lorna and I'm the Outreach Officer for the Alderney Wildlife Trust. As you know we're currently in lockdown, that's why the team and I have been working really hard to come up with some activities that focus on putting um, nature into recovery here in Alderney and we want you guys to be a part of that as well. So today I'm going to show you how to make a bird box using a bird box kit from the Nest Box Company. So we have these kits available here down at the farm. So if you are interested, please send us a message and we can drop these around to you socially distanced and fully sanitized. We just ask that you make a small donation. Alternatively, you can go to the website, which is here and order your bird box online. So today we're going to be making a bird box with a 25 millimeter hole. So this is going to attract things like blue tits, um, cold tits and tree sparrows. Um, other, other bird boxes, for example, a 32mm hole will attract great tits and house sparrows. So depending on what bird you would like in your garden, um, you've got to choose the bird box accordingly. Right, let's get on with it then. Before we start making our bird box, it's important to make sure that we have everything we need. So you should have a side piece, a back, another side piece, the front of the bird box, the roof of the bird box and the base. You should also find a little black envelope which contains some sandpaper, some nails and a screw. You'll also need a hammer and a screwdriver to put everything together. So we're going to start by attaching the sides of the birdhouse to the back of the birdhouse. So from the rear of the back, so the side without the groove, we're going to nail in the two sides. So it's going to look like that once I have nailed it in, like that. So your birdhouse should now look something like this. The next thing we are going to do is the base. So you're going to insert the base so that it's in between the two sides and so that it's touching the back. Then you're just going to nail it in place. So your bird box should look something like this. Um, it doesn't have to be perfect. The next thing we're going to do is the front. So you're just gonna place the front on top of the box like that and nail it down, okay? Okay, so that looks pretty good. Um, the last thing to do is the lid, which just slides on, so using the groove, slide it on, should look something like this. Using the screw that's provided, screw it into the hole and just attach that to the rest of the bird box. Take the bit of sandpaper that's provided in your kit and just smooth down all the edges. Okay, so hopefully your box now looks something like this. Beautiful. And the last thing you can do if you want is to apply some water-based wood preservative to it, that'll just keep it lasting longer, but that's up to you, it is ready for placement. If you have any questions about where to place it, please email me at headofoutreach at oldneywildlife.org or you can message us on Facebook or Instagram. Okay guys, thank you, see you later.